Oh, yeah. 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 All the arts over there. So we can go check it out before they uh, start the auction. So are people allowed to drink or is it just the artists who are drinking? No, I think it's, it's probably not open bar. You have to pay for your stuff, but it looks like you can drink and bid on artwork. <laughs> I think it's similar to OAX, you know, like they have, you, know, you can pay cash bars. All right. This is cool. I guess we just start at one side and let's work our way down. We've seen most of these, but I don't think we've seen all of them. Yeah, we'll go through nice and slow here so you guys can see every single piece. And these were all done at the con over the weekend. Oh, that one's cool. Dude, these are sick. Look at these. Like a whole series with her and the wolf. That's cool. You gonna bid on any of these? Yeah, I might. It might get one. I really like that one. I know, those are really nice. I bid on that. I'll start that. Well, that's fun. Spider Man so cool. This one, I saw that person doing it today. And that's cool to the Beta Ray Bill. Oh, Beta Ray Bill, yeah. That's nice by Anton Boy. Look at that. Oh, yeah, and look at the Weapon X. That's crazy. We got the Lethal Protector homage. Dude, that was done by an attendee, but that's awesome. These are all original, too. They, some of them look like prints. Wow, that's a ton of really nice. Wow, I really like that one. Yeah, the animated look. Oh, no, it's cool. It's cool seeing all the different styles. You'll like that one, that Wolverine. Oh, that, that Nightcrawler. Yes. That's sick. Chris Stevens, Wolverine. Oh, the TMNT stuff. That's really nice, too. Cameron Johnson. Indy Island. Oh, there's Johnny. Yeah, that's a nice one. Johnny Desjardins on Batman. Oh, there's that, uh, down on the floor. That Superman that we saw earlier. That one looks really nice. Oh, yeah, there are some of them on the ground. There's yeah, the Doctor nice. Doom. And there's the Superman. Work. It's cool seeing what everyone chose too as like the medium. Tyler Cozley. Yeah, cool like <laughs> we should get our seats maybe too in a little bit. Oh yeah, it might get a little crowded. You want me to take a seat and you can take a look around? Oh right, yeah, maybe you get some seats and I'll, I'll okay. take a look at the rest of the bar. Do you want anything to uh, drink? Do you want a drink? <laughs> I'm gonna get a drink and get the seat. Okay, let me get the wallet. The bat. Oh, that's Ben Templesmith on Batman. Hugh Jackman, Wolverine. Wow, that one looks like it was worked on maybe by a couple different people. Oh, that is awesome. I really like that. The SpongeBob, Wolverine versus the Deadpool. Oh wow, look at that Punisher. That's awesome. Brian level Punisher. We got alien xenomorph. Jeff to call. Oh, that's awesome. 
Chrissy Zulo, Wonder Woman. No, I was from the guy with Yeah. Adriana Mello. Yeah, that's funny. Wendy Peeney, no way. That's awesome. Look at that. That's awesome. Oh my God. <laughs> That is beautiful. Uko Smith. Mm. Really nice black canary. Oh, and are these Ron Lim originals? That's a Ron Lim Silver Surfer original page. Mm. Chris Campana. Oh. Is that Chris Claremont? What do they do on here? It says Chris Claremont. Wow. It's like some Superman. Oh wow, look at the Steven Platt Moon Knight. That's awesome. It's like a fuller body version of the one I got in my sketchbook. It's really sick. You got the moon in the back. That's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie Jones. That one's really nice too. We got some footage earlier of this one getting done. Dave Dorman. It says Dan Pinosian, but I think it's inked by him. Tom Rainey. That's really nice. David Peter. And they got a whole other section down there. Not sure where Sarah is. Maybe we'll start at this end. We'll wait in line over here and look at all the cool art. Wrap our way around and see what Sarah's going to bid on today. That's so awesome. Oh my gosh, no way, is that an original Sakai? Opening bid of 500, that is insane. Oh wow, look at that. And these, Win oh my god, look at these Wendy Peeney originals. Wow, that's hard to choose a favorite right there. Which one would you rather have? Yeah, it's awesome. I wonder what those are going to go for. Look at this Popeye, though. The finalized Martin Zavala. Ghost Rider with the color. That just came out really nice. Can't really see that one the best, but it's Voldemort by Stephanie Lavaud. We got Nightcrawler. Almost missed the Spider-Man down here on the art book studio commission. Oh wow, look at that Hellboy. Like a younger version of Hellboy, that's awesome. Wow, I really like that. Gus Mark, that's sick. Look at that Hulk. Man, this looks like that was done with color pencil or something. Oh, that's really nice too. Nice watercolor. Looks like we got a published paid, uh, published page here by Carl Story. Looks like that might be Iceman, Cyclops. Look at that. Lord of the Rings, Daniel Gavar. Old school X-Men, the original X-Men. Got Hairless Beast down there. That one's really nice too. Oh, here's, here's 
here's the big one. Let's see what this one sells for. Really awesome piece. Scotty Young, original art. Very big piece too. Tony Moy, wow, look at that Tony Moy piece. That's beautiful. Scott Hanna, Scarlet Witch, Andres Labrada on the back girl. So hard to pick a favorite. J.K. Woodward, wow, look at that. Michael Golden. Bud Root. Look at that awesome Batman. Oh, look at that storm. That's awesome. David Finch. Oh, he's selling another. Um, oh, I, I like the, 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 the. I think that's Walking Dead page. Yeah. David Finch, Walking Dead. Snake Eyes and Storm Shadow. Tommy Lee Edwards on Mad Max. Look at that. Oh, look at Andy Bennett with Kermit. That is so awesome. Kermit and Man Thing hanging out. That TMNT is really nice too. Old school Batman. Golden Age Batman there. TMNT Usagi. Oh, almost missed this down here. J.G. Jones. There's another one from that Stephanie Labog. Really nice. Hella and Thor. Steve Mannion. Now look at that awesome Tarzan. Wow. Wolverine. First the Sentinel, and then we're getting to the end of the original art here for the auction. We got Black Cat from Marshall Hinson. Oh wow, look at that one. I really enjoyed that. Mike Mayhap with Deadpool and Wolverine. Ryan Brown, oh wow, look at Ryan's, that's awesome. Super original piece right there. We got uh, a sick Godzilla right there. That's impressive. Dude, that Godzilla is awesome. It's a meme Godzilla. Yeah, right? The new one from the new movie that just came out. What is that right there? Ryan Oakley on the cheese spawn. Look at that, wow. Scarlet Witch, I think that's Mephisto. Kevin, wow, look at that. Kevin Nolan on the Batman. We got Death. Janet Lee, wow, look at that. Holy hand. So, wow, look how big that Silver Surfer is. We got Black Bull and Medusa. Looks like we got a double splash page here. We got Dr. Doom. That thing's pretty good too. Sandy Gerald and Dr. Doom. Awesome looking Captain America. 
Andy Bellinger, Captain America. Jim Rugg with the Indy Island. And it looks like the final piece is right here. Kayla Valerio. So that is all the original art that is going to be for sale at Heroes Con this year. We'll see what it all sells for. What? You gotta go get a bidding number? You're gonna bid on stuff? I don't know, I need to take a look over here. Do you see anything you want? There is like some crazy artwork from like Stan Takai and like some actually really expensive stuff with like pre-bids already at $500 okay. and stuff. What? Pre-bids? Yeah. Oh dear. Okay, well let me look at the wall real quick and then I gotta get a bidding number. Okay. So stay here, make sure no one takes our stuff. Okay. okay. Alright everybody, it's pretty crazy around here right now and it, it's not even starting yet. We still have a little bit left. I'm not sure how much footage I'm going to be able to record of the auction. Um, I'm going to try to record as much as I can for you guys. But uh, yeah, we're just going to be recording the artwork and what it's selling for. And then, um, yeah, I think we're going to be here all day. So buckle up. It's going to be a long video, though, but we're probably going to be here all day going through this artwork. And Sarah's going to be bidding on stuff, too, so we might come home with something. Let's see. Congratulations on another wonderful show. Uh, we've got so many amazing pieces in the art auction tonight. Uh, anything that you want to say to the fans before we get going 100% here? The best thing always is just thank you for being here again. Um, it, it wouldn't happen if, if y'all were here. Who would care, you know? Um, I've gotten a lot of compliments and I really, really appreciate that. People say, so uh, thankful for what you've done, or thank you for what you've done, and all I did was just pay for the venue, you know, I mean, <laughs> you guys get it done. Uh, I, I really do appreciate the support, I appreciate the, the word of mouth, that's, that's how this thing grows from year to year. Uh, folks come for the first time and have a good time and they tell somebody else and they come for the first time and it just keeps going and going so uh, thank you so much if you do not have a bitter number a bitter card it looks like this you can get one by going right over there to that table and those fine people will help you get signed up it's very quick it's a quick process just remember if you hold this up you are bidding if you hold it up to like wipe sweat from your brow, you are bidding. You bidding? You hold right. it up to blow your nose, you're bidding. So we, That's wait. how Trey and I are going to perceive it. So please do not hold this up unless you think you are bidding. Or else we're going to have a really awkward conversation later. Once again, what is on the screen is what you are bidding on. Let's open this up at $100 and see where it goes. Remember to hold your bidder card up so that I can see it. I've got $100 in the back. Who wants to go 125 Got 100 looking for 125. Everybody pay attention. It's the item that's on the screen up here, our first item of the auction. We're at $100 in the back looking for 125. I gotta keep I gotta keep this one going quick, guys, because we got a lot of pieces. So we're gonna do hundred dollars going once. There's 125 right there. Anybody at 150? I got 125 right here. 125 going once. 125 going twice. Remember, if you hold up your card, I think you're bidding. Sold for 125, bidder number 288. Full color piece here, take a good look at this. It's on the screen right up here above where we are. Jonathan Wayshack. Let's open this up at 200 and see where it goes from there. I got an opening bid at 200. This piece right here, full color. I got 200 back here looking for 225. 200 looking for 225. Anyone at 225, I got 200. Guys, I gotta keep this going quick. 200 going once. 200 going twice. Sold for 200. Bidder number, please. 59, thank you very much. We're getting something tonight. We're getting something tonight, dude. This going cheap. I might get this. I think people are waiting for specific pieces they and they're are. gonna go for crazy money. Yeah. Right. Okay, this is Artist 24 by 4. Artist Alley Table 104. Savage Land Rogue. Is that what we got? Oh, give us one second, guys. I need an opening bid of $100. Anyone at $100? Anyone at $100? Anyone at $100? How about $75? Who wants in at $75? I got $75 right here looking for $100. $75 looking for $100. $75 right here. 
take a good look at it. 75 right here. It's a large piece of art. 100 in the back. I'm looking for 125. I got 100 in the back looking for 125. 100 in the back looking for 125. $100 going once. $100 going twice. Sold for $100. Bidder number 167. Alex Saviak, one of the quintessential Spider-Man artists for Marvel Comics. His run on Web of Spider-Man is unparalleled by many. This is a great classic image by Alex Saviak, one of the greatest Marvel Spider-Man artists who ever lived. We're very happy to have him back here at Heroes. That's right, he also worked on the daily comic strip with Stan Lee writing it. All right, let's kick this off at 250 and see where it goes from there. I got 250 here, what, 300? 350 in the back? 350 and 32? Okay, I got 375 over here looking for 400. 400 right here. Looking for 425. 425 in the back. Looking for 450. 450 right here. 475. 500. You want to go 525? I got 500 here. You want 525 in the back? I got 525. Looking for 550. 550 right here. Number 12. Got 575 in the back. Looking for 600. 575. Looking for 600. Anyone at 600? There's 600 right there. You want to beat that? We can, let's go to 650. 650 right here. I got 650. Looking for 700. 700 right here looking for 750. I got 700 looking for 750. $700 going once. $700 going twice. Sold. Who was it? Hold it up. Okay, we got 800 right here. I'm sorry. It was in time. 800 right here looking for 850. Do you want to beat 800? Okay, we got 850 right here. You want to go 8? You want to go 900? I got 850 right here, looking for 900. 850, 850 going once, 850 going twice. Sold for 850. Bitter number. Oh goodness gracious! Sorry. Allison Blair Dazzler with the gorgeous, gorgeous hair, everyone. Let's start this one off at $100. Who's going to go 100? I got 100 here. Who's going 150? I got 150. Who's going two? I got two. Who's going 250? I need 275. I got, I got 275. I need three. I have 275. I need 300. 275. Anybody going to go 300? Two, I got 300 here. I need 350. I got 350 there. I need three. I need 400. 350. I need 400. Who's going to go 375? 350 going once. 350 going twice. Last chance. 350 sold. Hold up your number, please. 350 to number 63. 350 to number 63. The great artist June Brigman and Roy Richardson got a gorgeous pinup piece here from them. There we go. All right. Power Pack pinup from June and Roy. Let's start this one off at $500. Who's going to go with five on the Power Pack pinup? Yeah. Let me see it. Let me see it. It's right here. It's here. Who's gonna go $300 on the Power Pack pinup for us? I got three back here. Who's gonna go 350? I've got 300. I need 350. 300. Anybody gonna go 325? This is a steal, folks. $300. Going once, twice. Hold up your number. $300 sold to number 241. $300 to number 241 for item number six, I believe that was. Next up, we have four pages of original artwork from Dave Cockrum, donated by his wife, Patty Cockrum. These are four pages from the comic book series Soul Searchers and Company. They're from various issues. Let's start this off. We'll start this off. You're, bid you're bidding on all four pages in one lot. This is four pages of Dave Cockrum original artwork. We're going to start this off at two hundred dollars. Who's going to go? I got two. Who's going to go four hundred? I've got four here. Who's going to go five? I've got five in the back. I need six. I've got six. I need seven. Who's going to go seven? I've got six over here. Who's going to go seven? Who's going to go 650? I've got 650. Who's going 675? I got 650 over here. I need 675. I got 675. I need 700. 
I've got 675 and 8700 for Dave Cochran, my original artwork. I've got 675 going once, 675 going twice. Hold up your number, sir. 675 sold to number 176. 675 to number 176. Next up is item number eight. This is a gorgeous Joe Staten Huntress colored by Matt Webb. They've done this here at the show for us. Beautiful, beautiful piece of Huntress. Natalie, are you in the room? I think she had to leave. Um, a gorgeous, gorgeous piece from Joe and Matt. Ink and uh, watercolor dyes. This is actually watercolor dyes that Matt uses in his coloring. Who's going to start this one off at $100? All right, who's going to go $300? I got three here. Who's going to go four? I've got three. I need three fifty. I've got three hundred. I need three fifty. Anybody going to go three and a quarter? Three hundred going once. Three hundred going twice. Hold up your number. Three hundred sold to number eighteen. Three hundred dollars to number eighteen on the Huntress. Number nine. Item. Item number nine. Drew Moss. Spidey on a tightrope. Drew is a great artist, does beautiful, beautiful work, and often does it from very interesting angles you don't normally see in sketches and pinups. Let's start this one off at $200. I got two here, it's gonna go $250. I've got $200, I need $250. Anybody wanna go $225? For Drew Moss, I got $225, I need $250. I've got $225, I got $250, I need $275. You wanna go $275? I've got 250. Who's going 275? 250 going once. 250 going twice. Hold up your card. 250 sold to number 244. She loves me. From Yo Curry. Who's going to start this one off at $100? We got 100. Who's going to go 300? I've got 100 back here. I had a bunch of cards up. Who's going to go 200? I've got 100. I need 150. I've got 150 in the back, I need 175. I've got 150, I need 170. I got 175, I need two. I've got one, I got two in the back, I need two and a quarter. Two in the back, I need two and a quarter. Folks, if you're not bidding, please be quiet. Shh. Two in the back, I need two and a quarter. 200 going once. 200 going twice. Let me see your card. I got two and a quarter here. Who's gonna go 250? I've got two and a quarter, I need 250. Two and a quarter going once, twice, your card, sir. So two and a quarter to number 245. A lot of the pieces tonight, and I mean a lot, have a designation for a donation to the Hero Initiative or Team Cul-de-Sac. That's something new that we've We've sort of implemented last year, but we've implemented even more so this year. Some of the artists have asked that their donated items go to those charities, and we're great supporters of them, so we're honoring that. So that last piece, the money for that donation, for that piece, is going to the Hero Initiative. So as we go through, we will announce when we come across items like that. Hopefully we're going to catch them all, but just recognize that some of these items, the money is going to help pay for the con, some of these items, the money is going to go to one, both of those charities or split between those charities and the show. We'll try to catch that and alert that to you if that's going to help increase your bids, we would hope. All right, next up, I believe, is item number 11. This is from Morgan Heron. It is... There we go. It is Cyclops blowing apart a sentinel head. It's pen, ink, and screen tone on 9x12 Bristol. Morgan is in Indy Island, our fun place in the center of the show. Let's start this one off at $100. I got $100. Who's going to go two? I got $100 down front. I got two in the back. Who's going to go three? I got three down front. Who's going to go three fifty? I've got three. I need three. I got three fifty in the back. I need three seventy-five. I got three seventy-five down front. Who's going four? I've got three seventy-five. I need four. Anybody going to go four? Three seventy-five going once. Four in the back, I need four and a quarter. Four in the back, I need four and a quarter. Four hundred going once. I got four and a quarter down front, I need four fifty. I've got four twenty-nine five, I need four fifty. Anybody gonna go four fifty? Four twenty-five going once. Four twenty-five going twice. 
Show you my number, sir. 425 sold to number 33. It's Calvin, Calvin, Calvin and Hobbs. It's ink and acrylic on 11 by 17 Bristol, featuring Calvin's alter ego, Spaceman Spiff, Tracer Bullet, a dinosaur, and Hobbs. They're the mature grown up versions of these characters. Really fun piece, already framed for you. Let's start this one off at $200. I got two who's gonna go 250. I got 250 who's gonna go three. I've got 250 who's gonna go three. I've got 250, three down here, all right, I need 350, thank you. 300, I need three and a quarter. 300, we need 325. 300 going once. I got 325, I need 350. 350, I need 375. 350, you're out. Anybody else? 350 going once, twice. Your number, sir. 350 sold to number 223. 350 to number 223. These are all covers, and they are the pencils for the covers. A beautiful, beautiful ladies from Sora Song in Artist Alley 2012. These are from Dynamite Entertainment. Simon's Gate, issues one through four. The cover artwork in pencil for these pieces. I'm not going crazy. Folks, these are published original artwork and it is the original pencils. These are highly sought after items. We're gonna start this off at the very low price of $500. Who's gonna give us $500 for these four covers? I've got 500 here. Who's going to go six? I was going to go like four, like 100 a piece. Was Guys, this is less than the value of a single one of these covers. I've got six. Who's going to go seven? I've got seven. I need eight. I've got $700. I need eight. $700. I need eight. Anybody going to go 750? I've got 750 here. I need 800. 750 over here. I need 800. I got 800. I need 850. I've got 800. I need 850. I got 850, I need nine. 850, I need $900. 850, it's a steal, folks. 850 going once. 850 going twice. I got 900, I need eight, uh, 925. I've got 900, I need 925. 900 going once. 900 going twice. Your number, sir? Sold to number. Is that 98? This is from Chaz. I love this piece. I think it's gorgeous, it's fun, and it's all, all about what collecting comics is about. We're all nerds in one way or another. We're all geeks. And this really fun, full-color piece is a crayon draw, a drawing of the character Apple reading comics he's purchased from Heroes Con while Grape scolds him for being a nerd. We're all just like Apple. Let's start this one off at $100. Who's gonna give us $100 for this piece from Chaz? I got 100 in the back, who's gonna go 125? Anybody wanna go 125? Hold up your card, sir. $100 sold to number 264. Gorgeous, gorgeous Beta Ray Bill piece. It's nine by 12. Let's start this off at, we'll start it off at $50. I got 50 back there, who's going 75? I got 75 here, who's going 100? I got 100, I need 125. I got a buck and a quarter, I need 150. 150, I need 200. I got 200, I need three. I got three here, I need four. I got four in the back, I need 500. 400 going once. 400 going twice. Hold up your card, please. Item number 16 from Andy Rummel in Artist Alley 2113. That, that's, a, that's a different take on the never-ending story. This is a Trey You the Warrior, not a Trey You the Boy. This is from Andy Rummel. Beautiful, beautiful piece here. It's on the easel. We maybe should have some uh, post-it notes over those um, chesticles. Um, let's start this off at $100. I got 100 here, it's gonna go 150. I've got 100, I need 125 for a Trey You the Warrior. I've got 100, anybody gonna go 125? 100, anybody going 125? Come on, never ending story fans. 100, going once, twice. I got 125, I need 150. 125, anybody going higher? Going once, 
twice. Hold up your card, sir. Item number 17 from Jason Horn. We've got the dark seat. Is it dark seat or dark side? Dark side. That's what I always thought. All right, dark side painted on canvas from Jason Horn. That looks like straight out of a, a 60s or 70s uh, rock album here from Jason Horn in Indy Island. Let's get, start this off at $100 for Jason Horn's Dark Side. $100. I got 100. Who's going to go 150? I got I got 150 over here. Who's going two? I got 150. I need two. Anybody going to go 175? I've got 150. I need 175. 150 going once. Twice. I got 175 in the back. I need two. 175. I need two. 175 going once. 175 going twice. Your number, sir. 175 sold to number 189. This is an homage, Mini Marvel's cover recreation of Venom Lethal Protector number one. Chris is currently working on Venom right now, so it's even more apropos. Love Chris's work. He's, he's been a Heroes Con regular for many years. We love seeing him back here at the show year after year. Um, let's start this, for this cover recreation, let's start this off. We'll start it at 100 and see where we go. I got 100 back here who's going 150. I got 150 who's going two. I got two in the back, I need two and a quarter. I got two and a quarter who's going 250. I got 250, I need 300. I got three, I need 350. I've got three, I need 325. I've got 300, I need 325. 300 in the back. I got 325, I need 350. I got 350, I need 375. I've got 350, I need 375. 350. 350 going once. 350 going twice. Hold it up, please. 350 sold to number 160. Next up, item number 19. This is from Jeffrey Allen Love. It is Weapon X from Jeffrey Allen Love. Last year, if I recall correctly, the piece that Jeffrey did for us went for four figures and then some. This is a beautiful piece, 11 by 17, mixed media from Jeffrey Allen Love. We'll start it at 200. Who's going to go? I got two, I need three. I got three, I need four. I got four. Who's going to go five? I got five. Who's going to go a thousand? I got a thousand. Who's going to go 15? Who's going to go 1,500? I've got 1,000. I got 1,500. Who's going to go two? I've got 1,500. Who's going to go? Who's going to go 1,750? Who's going to go 1,600? I got 15. I need 1,600. I've got 1,500. I need 1,600 on the Jeffrey Allen Love Weapon X. 1,500, folks. Got 16. Who's going to go 17? 16. Who's going 17? 16 going, uh, 17, I need 18. 17, I need 18. 17 over here in the back, I need 18. 17 going once. 17 going twice, hold up your card, sir. $1,700 to number 160. $1,700 to 160. Now Koi is next, yeah. Item number 20 from Koi fam, we had a day Alex Saviak Spidey earlier. We've got this gorgeous, gorgeous headpiece of Spider-Man acrylic painting from Koi fam. <laughs> Spidey's doing flips for us. Spidey's doing his flips for us. Let's start this off at two hundred dollars. 